Hello you, welcome to Geekism and welcome back to the movies as we uh, crack on here then. So in the last episode we got our Detroit Crime City out, which was a bit of a weird one. And uh, Raising the Bar is uh, underway as well. So we'll probably start working on a new action movie. I was going to do a custom um, romance one, but that's we've, we've got one of those being done. So uh, Jasmine Brooks, you're not until scene 7, so you can do some PR my love. There we are, thank you. Uh, right then, so... Trailer plush owned by Jasmine Brooks. Maintenance level. Well, get it maintained then. Why don't you? Uh, we've got an actor down here, Peter Molyneux. Peter Molyneux? <laughs> um, romance. And so we've got a bit of romance experience. 21. What, what's our romance cast like? They're all pretty young still and hip and with it, aren't you? Um, yeah, you're not actually a really an upgrade on any of our guys, so we're going to leave you. We're going to leave you there for now. Maybe make it, I don't think we can make you into an extra, can we? Maybe an extra, just so you're on the payroll at least. Um, nobody else hanging around for jobs? No. Have we just done all research? Because if we've done all research, then our scientists can go and do another job. But, I don't know, we can't have done all research, surely. Hmm. Oh, I'll we'll keep an eye on that. Okay. Anyway, let's um, let's get started on um, a new movie. I think I'm just trying to see if, if there's anything going on around the uh, hashtag spooky door. Anything we need to do around here? Uh, oh, I'll tell you what we do need to do. Actually, let's get. Um... You what? I said oil the door. Oil the door. Oil the door. No, we don't need to oil the door. The doors. It's a feature now. <laughs> um, what's the set maintenance like on here? Come here. Repair level. Let's get all of our uh, sets repaired. Yep. And. Yep. And. Yep. And. Yep. There we go. There's an award ceremony about to play, take place. There we go. Why can't I see this set? Do we, can we zoom out and see it? Where are we? Can't even remember where I built half of these now. Oh, there it is. Nope, can't even see it that way. I want to see what the, what the maintenance is like, but it's not showing me. Um, where else? Current city street. Where else do we film? Urban bar. So we'll make sure the urban bar is pretty good as well. And then we'll see the, re, uh, the movie results, see if we've won anything this year. We should have won a couple of things. We've had some pretty good movies. We haven't had the number one movie, unfortunately, but we've had some pretty decent stuff. Um, where's Urban Bar? Is that it? Oh, yeah, that, that's it there, isn't it? Okay, so let's get the uh, maintenance level up on you. It's pretty good anyway, to be honest. Um, but we'll make sure it's good, because it's an easy way of increasing the... Uh, Oily door. It's an easy way of increasing the quality of the film. Okay, here we go. Uh, hi, John Lennon and Marilyn Monroe. Uh, oh no, 75. No, it's a bit late for Monroe. Uh, come on then, I'm not going to go through all these. What have we won? Come on. There we go. What's that one? Uh, best acting performance. Good. Um, what else? Is that it? Oh god, we're not doing too well here. Oh, that was one. What was that one? Most prestigious studios loss, I'll take that one. Uh, what else is that there? Best employer, nice. Um, good. Still need that four grand in the bank for our urban wall section. <laughs> um, so we've got... Uh, makes movies appear fresh, whatever the content, that's good. Boost the quality of all movies featuring that certain star and scientists research faster. Yeah, we've, got, we've had that one a lot. Um, so... Uh, that's good. So that means that that means this will look fresh, even though it's all pretty new anyway. Actually, so we haven't got to worry about that. Um, it means we could probably do a, a do a cool western or something. No, we've done western. We've done sci-fi. Let's do a, an action movie, but let's set it in these new modern sets we've got. In fact, there's some that we've hardly used. Look, there's this bathroom one here that we just haven't done anything with. Let's see if we can make one up. Suburban living room we've hardly used, although that last movie did use it a little, I think. Subway. All these newer sets that we can use that we haven't used much. So let's uh, let's look at doing one here. Then here we go. Uh, here we go. 
Advanced Movie Maker. Come here. So we're going to make a action movie. And it's going to be called something in a minute, but we'll decide as we go. So, Kieran Nee. Um, yeah, you're going to be our... No, which one? No, Daniel Purcell, you're the better one. So you're our lead. Oh, no, hold on. You're the action guy, aren't you? Simon Forrester. Yeah, you're the lead. Sorry, I forgot. And then supporting and Kieran, support. you're already there, supporting as well. Okay, so... I mean, gangster. We haven't done like proper gangster yet. Like a proper like ga you know like moles, you know uh, gangsters and moles. We could do something like that. Proper sort of period piece. So let's drop Simon Lake into, um, into costume and go for formal. And oh, like a PI movie. That's something we haven't done either. Yeah, let's do a private eye movie. Okay, you're looking good there. I'm not sure about the specs, but I suppose they kind of fit the fit the feel, don't they? Okay, so you are the good guy. All right. Uh, Dan Purcell, you're going to be the police chief. I've decided. Uh, formal work. Yeah, work. Uh, police. Oh, that's quite a modern one. More of a police chief outfit, if there is one. Let's have a look. That's an old police one. Classic police. Um... Mm, I guess it's going to be more. I mean, like, let's do something like that, just because it's cool. Just, I'm just trying to think of stuff we haven't used much before. Um, okay, and then you're going to be the bad guy, Kieran. Nee, I feel bad, Kieran, but you just you look like a bad guy. Do you know what I mean? He's just got the face of a bad guy, isn't he? Um, we don't need underwear. We don't want him as a. Oh, hold on, what was that? Is that a vampire? Is it? Yeah, we don't want you as a vampire either. Uh, futuristic, no military. I don't think so. That would probably be a bit weird. Western, no. That would look out of touch. Um, so we're going to go formal, and we'll just go for a sweet-ass suit, I think. I mean, we could go We could go gangster. I mean, it kind of fits, doesn't it? It's uh, This is like a, like a nice black hat, black and white hat. Yeah, it looks pretty good. Yeah, go on then. We'll go. We'll go gangster. It can be a typical bad guy. Yeah, that's pretty good. That old. It's it's a bit. It's not quite period, but we're getting there. Um, and it's going to be called. Uh, it's going to be called something to do with Private Eye. Um, Pi. Oh, let, no, no. Let me think. Let me think. Search for. Search for. Cagney Malone. Okay, and you're going to be. And Kieran Nee is going to star as Cagney Malone. And the uh, PI is going to be called... Um, a P what's a good name for a PI? Uh, Harry... Um, a Harry... Oh, God. Why, why can't I... Harry... Uh, Fontaine. I think we might have had somebody called Fontaine before. I don't know. I'm just trying to think what fits... Uh, and you're going to be Sergeant. Um, what's the what's the letters for Sergeant? That isn't it. Sergeant. No, off. No, you'd be an officer, wouldn't he? Officer. Um, Dudley. Officer Dudley. Okay, cool. Uh, yeah. Okay, that's good. So the intro is going to be. We've got that uh, suburban. It's like an office, isn't it? Let's have a look urban office with zero novelty value but that doesn't matter because we've got the we've got that award that means it's going to be okay so uh we want um we want him to be sort of at his desk really um intro return off suggested so static one what are you oh my god we don't want any of these people in here so let's just turn them all off for a second okay and uh, what does it look like yeah, okay, so he's sat at his desk, so let's turn him on. Whee, they all come in. Um, so, where are you? Simon Forrester, you're going to be at your desk. Okay, and then props. Can we make the computer a keyboard? Early computer. Hmm, I'd rather it be a typewriter, to be honest. So, if we get rid of it... 
And uh, well, we need one of them. Let's make it an early one then at least. Uh, that chair can stay the same. The phones can stay the same. There's guns apparently. Oh, they're just on people that we don't want. So let's just turn all them off. Um, okay, now did most of those go away? Oh, they hang around still. Yeah, but we'll leave all those as is. So it's just him on his computer. So what does that look like? Yeah, that's a good shot. Um, okay, so this is like, it would be in the film, it would actually have like, it was a cold Sunday morning. You know, he'd be talking over himself, wouldn't he? You look like he'd, he'd be the, uh, what's it called? The, uh, the monologuing dude. So let's have another one of that, but from a better angle. And intro, not suggested. Let's have, I want him to be like typing. Uh, oh, reading a book could be good. Uh, boss report. What's that one like? Yeah, you, you, you get out. Is this something we can use? Take a seat. Okay. Okay. Okay, I think I, I think I like this, but I'm going to throw it all around. So you are now going to be at the desk, actually. No. Yeah, you. Can we do that? Yeah. And then you're not in it. Um, but you, P-I, are. Okay, so now the policeman needs help, so he calls in a P-I. That's what I'm thinking. Oh no, we need to change this colour else it'll be filled with an extra. Like so. Okay, good. So let's go back to scene one. Okay. And let's make uh you be typing. Okay, so we can move this there. Let's add a um let's add a guy walking in. Enter. Uh, and I mean to enter we can change it can't we let's look what that looks like yeah that's what we want so we make you that and we make you that and the PI is coming in okay cool and then we drop that in between those so now we've got guy chats on the computer PI enters and then the boss says, oh man, we need help with searching for Cagney Malone. Okay, so that's the intro. Now he's off and now we've got that moving car. Well, where's that moving car? That's a good one. Uh, City Street. No, not yet. Mm, traveling vehicle. There we go. Um, just want like a drive along one, to be honest. Uh yeah, here we go. Are these just regular ones? Let's have a look. Yeah. Can we put somebody in the seats? No, it's genuinely just an empty car. Well, that's useless then, isn't it? Um, try that again. But have him actually drive this time. Uh, turn off suggested. So cranes there, no good. Zooms. I mean, I feel like I should still be able to put people in them. Uh, UFO? Monologue? Oh, monologue, that could work. Someone delivers a monologue. Let's see what that one's like. Oh, mood. Uh, no, this is weird. No, we can't have you talking to yourself. But, uh, no. Thank you. There we go. Uh, I do want to have him in the car. So enter a car, I guess, is probably the, the, the better thing, isn't it? So enter. For enter car. Now we can we can do this. So now it's him gets in. Yeah, there we go. Uh, and we can make all of these invisible. There we go. There we go. And then we need to set the backdrop to be... 
Um, let's have a look. Bar exterior. What's that one like? That's pretty good. I wonder if there's more of an office-y one. Uh, city street. City street corner. Yes, that's better. Okay, so City Street Corner gets in his car and then off he drives. So I literally just want him driving. Cop asks for a driver's license. A driver is hijacked by a passenger. What's that one look like? Hmm, it's more of a taxi thing, isn't it? Huh? Okay, we're off. Oh, it's a pretty good scene, isn't it? It doesn't, I mean, I don't think it really makes sense in our movie. I want him to just sort of do a regular drive away. It gives us all ideas, doesn't it? Um, car, car and drive. A jogger is surprised to see a, a driver is surprised to see a jogger keep up. An interior shot of a car crash. Car chase. An interior shot of a car. No. Four, ah, driving. There we go. Four people drive along. That's what we want. That's perfect. But all of these now become thingies like that. There we go. Uh, the car itself we need to change because it's gross. So let's make it a nicer car. Uh, not a police car. Not a 50s car. What are you? 40s police car. Standard 40s car. I guess 40s is as old as we can go. What are you? 60s police car, 60s sports car. Let's go 40s car. No, maybe not 40s. 50s? Oh, that one's quite nice. Or do we go 60s? Yeah, let's go 60s. Let's play this as 60s. The car has dated it. <laughs> um... And we'll do the same on this one. That one, isn't it? There we go. Lovely. And the backdrop needs changing. It's annoying that you have to do these every time. It'd be nice to be able to set it. Okay. Uh, all right. So we need to do... Um, let's see if we can do an exterior one. So urban city street. And let's uh, turn off suggested, but look for uh, cars. Seems to be cars in. Car pull up. Walk and talk. Enter carry into home. There we want. We want a, a car carrying four people pulls up. A car with two people sitting in the front seats pull up. Yeah, that'll do. Yep. That'll do nicely, but the car's empty, and it's not that car. It's that car. Is that this? Yeah. The right car, wasn't it? Standard 50s car. Oh, no, no, it's 60s, wasn't it? Yeah, it's that one. I think. Oh, I've got to go back and check all the old ones now. Let's have a look. Yeah, it says that greyish one. Yeah, okay, cool. So he gets in outside the police station. He drives along for a bit and pulls up. All right, it's a bit dull, but again, lots of monologuing. This is a PI movie, so there'll be lots of monologuing. So here then, um, inside the city street, um, we want to see him get get caught, you know. Uh, let's have a look. What's jolt? Explosion jolt someone, no. Um, dog attack? Someone is attacked by a vicious dog. Wow. Um, a car drives around the corner, then accelerates. No. We might do a car chase, though. Someone walks into view with a rifle. No. Uh, explosion, no. Find courts, no. Or in blanks. This is a sort of movie. Uh, sneak up. Someone sneaks up behind a guard with a gun. That could work. That could work. So we need to swap these around. 
Yeah, so you are this guy, uh, you are this guy, and then we need to just adjust the props a little. So, yeah, your gun needs to, does it have to be a rifle? Yeah, you are going to be holding it no matter what, aren't you? Um, AK-47, let's go for something a bit more like Tommy gun. Yeah, Tommy gun, does that work? Yeah. Okay, there we go. That one. Yeah, that's good. And then and then he turns around and gives him a fist fight. He gives him a good old <laughs> I won't say it. Uh fist fight, there we go. Ready fist fight. Two people get ready to fist fight. Two people fight with their fists. So what that looks like. Yeah. That's pretty good, but you need to be. You need to be you. Okay. Oh, that's good. They both crack their knuckles off each other. What's the setup here? Level violence level extreme. <laughs> Go on, beat the crap out of him. Oh, jeez. Who wins this one? We got. Oh, God. This is intense. Oh, my word. Strangled him. Who wins, though? Oh, that's good. Yeah. Oh, Christ. <laughs> uh, all right, here's the winner. Yeah, that's good then. We'll take it that way. Um, stand around is one that I keep seeing pop up and I think would work well here. Or is it gather around? Gather around, yeah. Group of people gather around a dead body. All right, but he's not going to be dead. But we won't tell people that. Uh, let's turn it off that view because I want to be able to see what's going on a bit better. There we go. Yep, there we go. Okay, so you are that one. Um. Toggle crane off, so let's have a look at this. Oh, yeah, that's good. So, let's make you you. Yeah, police comes over as well. That's good. So, we need to make sure you and you don't turn up. There we go. So you're not terrorist. You come over. Tut, tut, tut. And the policeman comes over. Okay. Good. And then the resolution is going to be uh, pay. No, not pay phone. No. Money. Give money. There we go. Because the policeman's got to pay the PI, hasn't he? That's perfect. I just need you two guys to swap over. Yeah. Okay. And then um, let's have the moving vehicles again. Um, we didn't put a car chase in, did we? We probably should have done. Um, romance, no, not romance. I like the idea of backseat, though. Let's see what it looks like. Oh, my God. <laughs> no, this is not the sort of movie we're doing. Let's see what happens if we make you invisible, though. What does he do then? Because that looks like he's been... Robbed, you know. Oh, empty seat. <laughs> Maybe not then. Back to him. And oh, see that? It looks actually looks pretty good. Looks like he's annoyed. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, like apart from the empty seats, it actually looks pretty good. Apart from that bit there, we could always throw it into the edit, I suppose. 
1940s car, 1950s police car, and, oh no, not you, e backdrop, there we go, date, okay. Travelling vehicle, four, no, not four, exit, four, drive along, I just want, like, driving along. And I've suggested for exit for driving or like for drive away is the sort of thing I'm looking for. Oh, what's car passenger seat? Internal shot of a passenger getting into a car before the driver pulls away. Well, maybe that one would be better for us then. Let's have a look at what that one looks like. Oh, no, that's no good. No, he's too, too happy. <laughs> um, oh, that's sorry. I just realised what I do need to do. I've got the wrong actor there. That you're the bad guy. This is the idea is that he's locked up in the back of the car. You see. I just want it driving away. Just, just the car driving away. Um, Stake out. Drive normal. Someone drives a car. What are the options there then? Medium, mood, happy, speed, slow. Hmm. No, that's not good either. I want to see the guy in the back. So it's gonna be it's gonna be the four drive car in it, and we just turn two of them off. Four Turn that off and search for four driving. There we go. That's what we want. Four driving. Uh, there we go. And then you are driving. And no, you are you. There we go. And then you two are both invisible. No, 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 not you. Ah, oh, crap. There we go. And there we go. Turn you off so we can see what it looks like. There we go. Um, can we change the mood? Mood. Happy. Sad. Sad. Okay. And then the backdrop needs to be that one. And the prop, the actual car itself, needs to be... Uh, 1950s police car. What's that one? 1970s police car. It dates it too much, I think, doesn't it? There we go. That one actually looks like a police car. Okay, cool. So, and then he drives him off. To, that's him driving him off to the station. Okay. So, what's this one then? Let's have a look at this one again. Um. So let's just move them around. Uh. Who's scared? No, I don't want to be scared. Neutral's fine. Um, I'd like to be able to adjust the camera angle on that one and maybe stick the car in it somewhere, but I won't. Uh, I was, yeah, just going to say about putting that one in, you see. Where's the actual shot being took place? Can we do that? Can we do something like that? Just to get the shot in? Yeah, that'll do. Just to give us a bit of a bit of running together. And it costs 14 grand. That's for the actual sets though, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, so let's go from this again. Copper's on his on his desk, typing up a report. In comes PI. Copper says, God damn it, Jimmy, I need your help. Whatever his name is, I don't know. PI goes looking for the guy. Drives along, pulls up, and then while he's looking with his Tommy gun, I'd rather him not have, but that's fine. Here comes the here comes the the the, the dude. They fight it out. He's on his bum. Uh, police come over. 
He gets put in. Okay, good. So there we go. That's a pretty decent little movie, that. Search for Cagney Malone. He's ready for casting. So let's get started on that. Uh, begin casting. Oh, press. Oh, what's going on here? What do we need? We need a director. That's fine. We have a we have a director. And who's a... Are you Jasmine Carr? Is it you? No, you are a romance director. So who's a action director? Is it you? Margaret Wells. Yeah. Uh, you could be a bit better at acting, but it's okay. Um, Good. Love interest? No. We haven't got a love interest. Four crew. No extras again. Oh, we should have probably threw a few extras in there, shouldn't we? Just to kind of up the quality of the movie a bit. I always forget to put extras in. Let's see if we can drop it back and throw a few extras in here and there. Okay. Um, Probably not in that first scene, but here where he's pulling up. Yeah, look there, we can have a few in. Um okay, are you extras? Yeah. You look fine. You and you. Are you all the same bloke? Let's get a lady in here. What about you? How do you look? Yep, yeah, that's good. Okay, let's see what that shot looks like now. There we go. Just puts a bit of life into it, doesn't it? And then here, are there any extras here? Only gun people. Um, is that someone hiding? Let's put somebody. Okay, let's put. Let's put Peter Molyneux as a drive-by cameo in this. Uh, and who else hasn't been used yet? There, you can be walking off that way. No, no, no. Uh, there, running in the background, like you've seen the gun. Ah! Okay. And then the fight. Probably nobody. And the end, probably nobody. Yeah, okay, that's good. Should we try that again? Boom. And now we've got five out of five extras there ready. Okay, cool. Just because it kind of ups the ups the quality a bit. I think it does anyway. In the next episode, we'll uh, we'll, we'll see how that turns out as well. And also, we've got uh, ra raising the bar still going as well. So we'll have to see how both of those turn out. Uh, thanks very much for watching. Hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, you can give us a like. It really does help out the channel. And if you're not already, don't forget to subscribe. Any thoughts, queries, or suggestions, you can pop them down in the comments. Fancy chat, you can find me on Twitter. I'm at John T. Sparrow. If you'd like to join in with the Geekism community, you can do so over on our Geekism Discord server. You'll find the link for that in the description. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you in the next one.